Welcome back everybody to Make Share Daily where you can go to get a new build each and every day. This week we have a theme, it's all about games. So the whole board is filled with video game type of stuff. So let's spin the wheel and see where we land. So a 360 controller, probably my favorite controller ever made. Let's go build it out of Legos. Let's go right now. So we're gonna build an Xbox 360 controller, five minutes, 221 pieces. So let's put the stopwatch in motion and then see what we can do. So 360 controller, uh, bumpers maybe on the top. These are gonna be bumpers maybe. Using that round, round portion on the bottom. We're gonna do a little bit of this to turn up the turn. Okay. So I'm trying to go two bricks high. We're already a half a minute in. Okay, so let's see. What am I gonna build the majority of this out of? And how can I get an angle? Okay. I'm throwing blanks here and ideas. Let's not worry about the bumpers yet. Let's figure out how we're going to do Okay, so maybe this and this, okay? And how can I do an angle? Like this, set up an angle. Not sure how yet. Given the pieces that we have, not sure if we're gonna be able to do an angle. Maybe something like this instead, okay. So let me get this a little closer to the camera. So the idea here is, is I'm gonna stagger. The bottom to look kind of like that. Okay. So I'm gonna build up, build up the colors. Again, I only have 221 pieces. So not a lot of bricks to pull from. And the colors, I am very limited in colors as well. So I'm gonna use what I have available. <clears throat> I'm gonna try to match them up as best as I can, but I'm not sure that it's gonna be 100% fruitful. So let's see what I can come up with. Some purple maybe on the top here. Pink on the bottom. Okay, that's not too bad. So you, you can see that I can hold it like a 360 controller. It's a little on the small side. If I had a lot more pieces, a lot more time, I think it would beef this up a little bit more. Um, maybe I might be able to do it that way. Let's see, let's give this top side a try. So I'm gonna make it angle out a little and then Add this purple piece back in like that and do the same for this side is angle it out just a little bit then purple or some other color in the, in the bottom here purple piece on top pink right there now see it it's got more of a gentle curve to it now Four minutes in, oh my, oh my, oh my, oh my. So something like this for the game pad. Ooh. Uh, buttons, buttons, button, buttons. I need buttons. 
We're almost out of time. Different color buttons here. And then something almost out of time. Okay, that's my 360 controller in five minutes of time. We just ran out of time. So that was a difficult build. That was very difficult. Um, I'm gonna continue this on and really make this a better build. So first off, I'm gonna add some structuralness to the bottom of this, uh, to the sides here. That's the first thing I'm gonna do like that uh, I like the roundness of the bottom it gives that 360 controller kind of look but I'm actually going to call up a picture of a 360 controller I was going off of memory I was going off of memory so this is what a 360 controller kind of looks like so there's definitely more buttons and definitely, um, definitely more buttons. So the yellow button is on the top, red button's on the side. Do I have a green? No. Um, and then blue. So we're gonna use brown here for the blue and then the green we'll use yellow. Another, oh no, I got one. Okay. So that is a little bit better. And blue will be purple. So there we go. So that is the controller there. But then we need to have the, the joystick parts. Hmm. So this looks more like a, a pad, a D-pad. Let's see what I can do here. I don't know what those little stragglers are. So I wanna get a joystick down here. Okay. Something like that. And then in the top, we need a D pad, which I could do something along these lines. Oh. I got an idea here. Oh, half of it came undone. So we're making a 360 controller. And then there's a big button in the middle. So if I take these out and I replace it with silver. There. So that looks like a 360 controller to me out of 221 pieces in five minutes of time. It slightly modified. I went over time with my modifications and I do apologize for that. But I did want to correct the problems that I had just based off of what I remember what a 360 controller was versus actually seeing it in a picture. So I guess I should call up a picture the next time I do one of these. Um, but that's a 360 controller. I kind of like it. I think it works well. We're gonna post it We're gonna take a picture of it right now If it can stand up look at that not too bad for a 360 controller 
Um, definitely the wrong colors for a 360 cooler. You want to have it black or white. But in this case, uh, pink and purple, a lot of people have modifications that they do to their 360 controllers. So I could see this as a modified color scheme. Okay, so thanks. And uh, we'll continue on. I'm going to take a picture right now. Thanks so much for watching. Here at Make Share Daily, we love to make things, especially with Legos. So these five minute challenges are a lot of fun. And if you want to play along, go ahead and pick up this classic Lego box with 221 pieces. You can pick them up for about $15 at your local Walmart or Target, and then you can play along. Or just use any other Legos that you have at your house. As long as you build that same topic, Find a way to share it with us on all of our social media. I'll leave it with this. Please go ahead and make something and share something each and every day. You'll be glad that you did it. And we would love to see anything that you make. So find a way to post it to us on our Facebook page, our Instagram page, or our Twitter account. And you will see all the links down below with, where you can get in touch with us. So thanks everybody for watching. And we'll see you tomorrow to make something new. See you later. Bye-bye.